I've been given a very warm welcome here today. Let's take to the headmaster's office. Um, <laughs> it's always difficult to go into that room <laughs> without feeling a pang of some sort of guilt. <laughs> that what have you done wrong? You know that thing. Memories came flooding back to Mick Jagger as he returned to where he grew up. It's kind of really weird. And you kind of go, and that's when this guy hit me. And that's why I punched this other guy up. It's all these kind of things. So it does trigger all these incredible memories. Go back to the sports field, was great. You know, you start looking out, and there it was, just as you kind of you used to have your fun days out there, athletics or playing football, rugby and cricket. And although he doesn't spend much time in Dartford these days, it seems to have a special place in his heart. It's part of your consciousness, you know, that you're brought up somewhere for like the, this very formative part of your life. And I, I, you know, I didn't move around, I was just here. So it sort of helps to create you in a lot of ways. And Dartford's a really odd place, and I was driving in, and it's so kind of suburban and urban, but then from the playing field, you can see the countryside. As well as taking a trip down memory lane, Sir Mick toured the centre named after him and watched a short performance by Dartford Grammar and local primary pupils. The wonderful thing about music is that it's always part of your life. You don't have to make it your living out of music, and you just have it in your soul. And in this sort of place, helps you develop that, where perhaps you never would have um, been able to get to some musical fulfilment. I'm very proud to be associated with this centre, which gives people from this area something that they can continue to develop their musical abilities and go on and keep those for the rest of their lives. And thank you very much, everyone that's been involved in this centre. Mick also saw the Dartford Cricket Club in action during his visit. And on coming back to his hometown, he's run into familiar faces, as well as some unfamiliar ones. I met a second cousin of mine that I never met before. But you get the feeling when you come here that you're related to half Dartford, because you saw this <laughs> other lady just show me this picture of um, me at some wedding. Her mother got married, and now I'm standing in front of my you know, grand school uniform on. 